Hello, collective. Welcome back to the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. Let's go ahead and find out what in the name of source is going on here. Um, okay, so we have... Uh, is this a union that's over? Some type of uh, collaboration between two people is not working out. Or some type of connection did not come together or a contract may be over. There may be some type of court case that's going on, possibly a divorce or something like that. Two people may be going through a, a separation in the court system. Uh, so more than likely this is a divorce or two people are not coming together because of some type of injustice taking place. <clears throat> okay, let's go ahead and get into it. Thank you for watching the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families. As always, I return to source. I return to sender. All negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. I call in only the purest of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energies. Whatever the enemy has stolen from you, it is returned to you. All evil and negative plans of the enemies against you are dismantled and being dismantled as we speak. As I have said, so shall it be. Judgment is final. All right, so we may have, uh, I guess this is like two people going through a separation or there's some type of relationship where there's no happiness, a lot of fighting, a lot of arguing. This could be two entities also that came together. Um, but I'm also getting like a relationship that's over, some type of divorce going on because something has been illuminated between two people, what they've been up to. There's also two people that are supposed to come together, but right now they're not coming together because there's some type of injustice taking place. It may be a group of people behind the scenes blocking two people from coming together or two like-minded people from coming together to manifest some type of new reality. So there's some type of disharmony going on um, in a divine connection that's supposed to be in this disharmony going on between two people that are not supposed to be together is what I'm getting. Um, maybe there used to be joy, happiness, and something in this connection, but there's no longer that. There's some type of injustice taking place, some type of bad karma taking place between two people. So maybe, maybe this is what I'm picking up on. Maybe someone tried to get another energy to see them as a twin flame soulmate or something, or maybe, and maybe they got this person to get married to them or propose to them, but there's some type of bad karma taking place between these two, some type of separation with the justice out here in the reverse with the three of swords in the upright. There's some type of uh, separation going on. So there's some type of breakup basically that is going on. They don't have to be married. It can just be that they've been together for a long time. Someone may have uh, bribe someone or uh, just manipulated someone into a relationship, into some type of commitment just to hold on to them, keep them stuck in some type of union. They thought was going to be abundant, but it's not abundant. Uh, so now there's some type of separation or a breakup going on, which is going to balance something out either for a masculine energy. Um, so this is kind of what we have going on here. There could be a, a queen of wands that may have put herself out there to be someone's equal, someone's counterpart, but something is playing out where it's that the truth is being exposed um, and there's some type of separation. This could be a breakup that's taking place within the next two to three days is what I'm hearing. Um, if someone is trying to figure out how to move on, there may be someone out here angry because a queen of source may be telling the truth or a queen of source is looking into something, uh, trying to figure out how to block some type of new beginning, block two people from coming together. So it could be that a truth was exposed by a queen of source as well. So maybe someone was working with a queen of swords in the court system but instead of the queen of swords uh, working with them to cause blockages and block someone from receiving what it is that's theirs or to block two people from coming together because I think there's something where they're trying to have someone caught up in some type of court case so that they're not able to move on they can stay stuck in some type of unhappy situation, unhappy relationship, whatever this is, but there's a queen of cups, I mean queen of swords that is looking into something basically I guess how people have been working to block someone or cause some type of stalemate in 
need someone to work and have them go from an eight of pentacles to a four of pentacles so instead of them being you know uh secure and study sturdy in life they've been having someone having the pinch pennies feeling insecure going through some type of financial like maybe someone used to be very abundant with the two of cups maybe people used to work with this person someone was busy manifesting some type of abundance for themselves and people did something to hinder this uh this manifestation right uh so there's something being looked into it could be an investigation maybe a queen of swords would like to apologize for something maybe they're seeing something from a different perspective she may be also upset that she even worked with these people um for some of you or this could be a queen of swords that's trying to figure out how she can cause a still me like she's still trying to figure out how she can cause more problems because this is someone that feels to learn their lesson or something like that um this is someone that's absolutely Absolutely burning behind the scenes going through a tower stuck in their mind about some type of new beginning coming into play uh, and the truth being exposed someone wanting to separate themselves from a karmic community karmic uh, relationship and take charge of their life and move on this could be a king of wands that's taking charge choosing to tell the truth living his truth take life at the bowl and kind of just move on right live um with in, live in honesty basically okay so there are people absolutely pissed off behind the scenes that this person is taking charge of their life um going through some type of healing wishing to partner up with someone else yeah he's healing he's going forward this came out sideways so that will let me know there's some type of uh, overindulgence that took place place someone has been abusing their power either in the legal system or in some type of community institu institution presenting themselves to be a temperance energy but it could be someone that's very manipulative has been overindulging when it comes to blocking someone's work someone's abundance someone's finances and all of this is coming to light and there could be an energy possibly the masculine king of king of wands that's starting to see the truth or knows the truth about what it is that's going on and people are heartbroken this queen of swords, uh, to be honest with you all, I'm not really getting a good vibe from this woman. What I'm getting is that this is someone that is uh, heartbroken because someone wants to work with you, like a masculine wants to work with you. She's heartbroken about that. Someone may be very pissed off. Yeah, they're very pissed off that this man wants to come together with you, give you some type of contract. Um, someone wants to balance something out. Someone sees you as an empress energy. They see the truth about you. They're looking into you. You're a queen of wands, empress energy, so you're someone that's quite fiery, but uh, in a good way, like you stand your ground and things like that. There could be like a duo in here as far as a queen of swords, a queen of wands, and an empress energy that have been working together. And there could be some type of court case going on with these three, or there's a court case coming up and they are being investigated and looked into. Maybe they didn't know that. Um, maybe the empress is the one that has these people up to their shenanigans to cause some type of heartache for maybe a temperance energy this could be a sagittarius a leo or aries it doesn't have to be um but the temperance is typically associated with those zodiac signs um but there is something going on where it's a, either three women within a community in a family have been working really hard to cause a temperance energy a lot of heartache a lot of headache betrayals and things that they keep him stuck in his mind they want him to give some type of offer to a queen of wands that is in a community but this is not someone that he wants to be with um um, there's another queen of wands empress energy that he has his eyes on that he would like to work with um but basically it's some type of manipulative tactic where it's that they want him to get married to this person the karmic is basically who they want him to get married to so that so that he can stay in a karmic energy and there's some type of revelation this man is going through or having about the whole situation maybe this has been like a blind mice just going about um taking whatever it is people give him and now that he knows the truth he's a burden uh and may want to have a new beginning with you but it's maybe hesitant to come towards you because maybe you may reject him and he's worried about you having this new beginning with someone else basically you manifesting some type of new beginning so someone may want to have closure with you in order to move things forward um so there could be some type of meeting that takes, takes place and this is something these people have been working for a long time to block from happening prevent from happening uh someone says over their dead body are these two going to end up together um this man could be in some type of relationship or with the with the higher fin out here 
Followed by the freaking Queen of Wands and the Empress energy. I think this is someone that's in a relationship, more than likely married. Um, I don't know if they have an older child or a daughter, or this could be someone that has a wife where the relationship is not exactly up to par, but also has like a concubine that he talks to or something. I don't know what the situation is with these three, um, but... There's basically he wants to be with someone else other than who it is they're trying to point him towards. Um, but there's a lot of chaos and just conflict, confusion, too much going on. There could be a family or a couple that's being looked into, being investigated. Um, the truth is being exposed about this couple. They, I don't know if they, maybe they're not aware that, that you all have been being watched by someone, either by the court system or someone very uh, high ranking, like an official has been watching you all. Um, so someone has been investigating a couple or a family, a community, everybody is being looked into. There could be some type of internal investigation going on. Yeah, there's an internal investigation going on. This is more than likely an institution. Um, there was some type of tower uh, there's a tower in reverse. So something didn't go according to plan. This is not like a natural tower. This is something that's being done by someone. A, ta a natural disaster is something that's by the act of God. But there's something where it's that people were trying to cause you some type of ending. But it's out here in the reverse. So something did not happen accordingly. Uh, it could also be a reversal because these people are going through some type of tower and you are go moving on with your life. So it's basically like people trying to cause more stalemates because this is what we've been picking up on this group for quite a while now. They've been cause, trying to cause stagnations, taking actions to cause a lot of blockages, confusions, manipulations, and things of that nature. Um, in order to block two people from working together or coming together, to kind of just defame and slander another energy and to manipulate a masculine, correct? Um, but they're going through some type of tower and you're going through some type of growth, some type of acceleration. You've taken control of your life, not really paying these people any mind. You're basically paying attention to what is in your cup, not, what in, what, not what is in these people's cup. If only everybody had their mindset, wouldn't life be a la di da di da It sure already would. Um, but there's a karmic couple out here. Um, that could be going through some type of ending they were not expecting. Could be some type of separation. This is a very karmic and toxic couple. Also, this Sagittarius or whoever this is could be stuck in some type of unhealthy relationship. And there's something that was done to keep him stuck in this relationship. There's something unholy going on. Something unorthodox. Something unjust that's going on in the court system. If this person is trying to separate from either a queen of swords or his ex-wife not ex-wife his i don't know who this is so this man he's trying to separate from somebody um but there's some type of trickery going on when it comes to the uh um if there's a court case going on or just in the situation period it's like they want to destabilize this person maybe he's going through some type of healing but they don't support him going through this healing so they're doing things behind the scenes to have him not be in a temperance energy they're trying to make sure that he's feeling uneasy uncertain uh having a lot of emotional turmoils and things like that not feeling uh steady in life they don't want him to feel like he's headed in the right direction basically they want him to just feel confused conflicted and overburdened way down they may be doing things within an institution to, feel, to make this man feel way down. They're giving him a lot of tasks, a lot of responsibilities and things of that nature so that he does not have a time to focus on what it is he wants for his future. So right now it's like, we, we need you to do this. We need you to do that. We need you to do this. Can you come do this? Can you come help us? Can, you know, M Mrs. Mrs. Uh, Mayberry in room 14 needs this. Uh, Doctor whoever needs this. This something. We have a customer that needs you to do this. Like they're trying to keep him busy and distracted, right? They're trying to hold on to him. They don't want him leaving. But this man has made some type of decision to move on with his life. This is someone that's very, very high ranking in the spirit realm. He's showing up as a temperance energy and uh, a higher fan. So this is someone that's very much gifted, um, very essential to the masses and things like that. But there is some type of bad karma taking place when it comes to this Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, or whoever 
whatever this is um they may have done something in the past maybe there was some type of betrayal um maybe they saw you betrayed them but you didn't really do anything to them you could be in your queen of source energy as well and maybe this person was told that you did something to them whoever told him this lie He's looking into it as well. It's like everybody is being looked into. And I don't think this man is really... I don't think this is someone that has time for the BS. There's something where it's like they're just lying and lying and lying to this person. So it's like they feel like if they tell him more lies, keep causing more manipulation. They're trying to cause him problems in the, in the court system. So this could be the person they're trying to have locked up, have trapped, something like that. Um, there's some type of injustice that's taking place, meaning they're trying to bring him legal issues to have him caught up in a court case with more than likely a queen of wands and an empress energy. Maybe they're trying to set him up as though he did something that he did not do, like he owes them money that he don't owe them. There is something, like they're just trying to keep him stuck in some type of situation that he has no business being stuck in. And they may have been doing this to cause a tower, but it's not going to go according to plan. Like they're trying to keep him stuck at, they're trying to keep this man stuck in some type of position in a company or in some type of commitment, but it's not happening. Like he's gonna end up moving on. And whatever relationship they're trying to block him from having, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. Like, even if it's just a relationship with Source, if it's just a relationship with someone completely different other than the person he has his mind on, it's going to happen. That This is not something these people can stop. So right now, this is just kind of like entertainment and a lot of foolishness going on with these people thinking that they can block this man's destiny. They are playing with somebody's destiny. And when he decides to step his foot down and actually take care of business, it's going to be really horrible for these people because this is not someone they should be playing with. From what I'm picking up on, this is not someone to be playing with. This is someone I'm seeing that used to be just like these people. So it's like you're playing with someone you know what they are capable of. This will be someone that may end up telling someone, don't give, don't, don't have me, you got me messed up. Like you have me after, like you know what I can do. Why are you playing on my time? Why are you playing on my top? Because this person is going from a, a, a justice in reverse to a temperance. So this is someone from the past that used to be just like them. And I don't know if they've forgotten what it is or who is who he is or what he used to do. But this is just someone that chose to do something to balance himself out to heal. But this energy is still within that person. So if he decides to retaliate against these people, they're going to be in some type of nightmare that they're going to live to regret. And again, used to be in this energy and now he's in here. Like someone used to be emotionally imbalanced, mentally imbalanced, not great, not that great of a leader maybe, but now he's choosing to balance himself out. Like they are playing with some type of, I wouldn't do this if I don't do that. Don't do whatever it is. Stop doing it. You're playing with hot water. You are playing with fire. Don't do it because this person here has no if ends, or buts about it. When it comes to entertaining that lower energy of himself when he's tried so hard to leave that behind, but they keep trying to pull him back into it, and he's not going to go back into it so he can stay there. He's going to go back into it so he can put them in their places. Like, I guess you all forgot who I am and what I'm capable of doing. You you don't forgot what it is. So someone may end up spazzing out on these people, but he's going to do it in a diplomatic way where it's like, it's a checkmate checkmate that they cannot come back from. So I don't know what these people think they're doing, but you are a plane with fire. Do not get this man back in his lower energy. It's not going to end up good for any of you. Maybe you all want him to do something where he spazzed out and then he ends up doing something to another party. No, that's not what's going to happen. He's going to turn on you all. He's going to turn on you all. Okay, there could have been a family or a couple trying to cause an, an ending either for this masculine or different energy, but they're not able to. Who, who, whatever, I think there's a star C or empress, these people are trying to cause an ending for. Someone is too developed 
is what I'm hearing. They're too established within themselves. Someone is too high vibrational. Someone is too committed. Someone is too strong for you all to just dis dismantle like that. So you're trying to cause stalemates. You see how you try to cause a stalemate, cause a tower. The tower is in reverse. That's the universe doing that. Because they know someone has done the work to get to where they are. You all think you're doing something on like a, a surface level. No, this is spiritual. There are certain people in life, these kind of people, they see things on a surface level. So what's beneath the surface, they don't see. They, they have to go to another party to tell them, hey, this is what's really going on. You need to chill. That like you are headed right down to smack bottom. These kind of people, they don't have insights. Like the ones trying to block this man from moving on, trying to have him cut up in some type of court case or have a, a feminine energy cut up in a court case or something. They don't see things be, uh, beneath the surface. It's all surface level for them. There's no like higher knowledge with them. There's nothing. They don't even know how to rationalize situations. Compromising is not part of, part of them. So it's like they're setting themselves up for failure, believing that they're doing it to somebody else. You all may want to calm down because you're about to put yourself in some type of, listen, calm down. Because I'm telling you, this is not just service level anymore. This is something that is spiritual, like the universe is all over this mess. So you, you listen, you see this right here? This is what's about to happen to a lot of you based on the decisions that you made. Whoever you are trying to block have caught up in the court case legal system that that's not happening it's like they want to send someone some type of communication and say we are sending you a cease to desist you need to stop talking about this you need to stop creating content or you need to stop showing up to work um you are being sued for this and they say you can't sue this person for anything because they didn't do nothing to you let's use social media for example let's use terror for for example a group of people watching me right and Something resonates with whatever it is they're going through, so they feel like it's about them. So they go and come up with some type of frivolous lawsuit, and they send send it to me and say, "We are suing you for this." And it's like I don't even know you. Who the f Who the f are you? Like who are you? It's a situation like that. Like they're trying to have someone caught up in a in a court case, and the court case is so frivolous they could even be paying a queen of swords within the court system to do something to a queen of wands upright. So. In this situation, I will be like the Queen of Wands. They're trying to send me some type of cease, cease to desist to have me caught up in some type of court case, right? But the whole time, I don't know these people. So now you got to prove that I do know you and I am aware of your situation. So even, so the fact that I'm aware of it, I got on social media and spoke about it. I don't know you, so you got to prove that I know you. And so then what they're going to do is... uh, uh, uh Create some type of fraudulent document, some type of fraud to make it seem like I've been communicating with them back and forth. Because these are people that are very malicious is what I'm picking up on. They're going to come up with some type of fraud, fraudulent document, make it seem that like we've been communicating. I've been aware of them all these years or something like that. Whole time, I don't know these mother effers from Adams. I don't know them. Not aware of them. Just doing my story my uh, stories on here just doing my reads maybe they're coming onto my platform to watch and i'm picking up on their energy but i don't know these people it's something like that some something just made up and they're trying to pay a queen of swords in the court system to have something go in their favor it said we know we know this court case is not legit but we want you to make it legit make it look legit they don't know it's a scam they don't know it's a setup and whoever that is, hopefully they respect their license enough to turn these mother efforts down because you don't want to work that hard to get to where you are just so you can throw it away for a bunch of clowns. It's something like that going on. Like these people are very meticulous, but the, the meticulousness is not sophisticated. It's all based on hate and just greed insecurities and that's all this person is going to see about them it's like uh you want me to what set someone up because you feel insecure because a man wants to go have a new beginning because someone is moving on with their life because someone is not responding to a situation the way you want them to respond because a man don't want to be with you that's why you you want me to what cause hindrances and blockages and some like someone is trying to make something legal that is going to be like a waste of time for the court system and they don't realize when the court system picks up on what is going on boy you're going Gonna, you're gonna have problems that you never imagined. You better not be wasting the court's time out here. 
you listen when you have you all ever interacted with people from the courts it can be like the clergy it can be like the person that answers the phone at the front you don't want to fool with those people they don't got time for your nonsense not today not tomorrow or any other day they don't got time and you want to go play on their time on their top when they find out what it is you're up to man you think you got connections now listen let this king of swords in the court system find out because it looks like he's he knows he has the truth let him find out that you all are trying to bring up some type of court case that is so frivolous and a waste of time you are all going to have problems and i'm telling you you better stop it you better cut it out what is wrong with you people about to trap yourself and this is what they feel too that they're trapped in situations that they cannot get out of living in fear like a relationship is over they're not able to hold a man in some type of relationship it's what they've been trying to do this sagittarius could be someone that's like a king of source and he's king of source in all these mother efforts every one of them that tried to come towards him a uh, baby come on 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 like, he don't got time today, tomorrow, or any day. This man is fed up with these people. But this is someone that used to be in low vibrational. Didn't care about what it is he did before. Was unjust. Someone is doing the work to balance himself out. And it has these people pissed off. Someone who have wanted to meet with you. Don't know that maybe you didn't get the communications. Because people are blocking the communications. This man may be afraid that you are either uh, talking to someone else or whatever. I don't know what this is. But there's some type of confusion going on. Someone may be trying to communicate with you, but they can't get in contact with you. You're not receiving the communications, and they don't know that. I'm telling you. You see him? Yeah. Yeah. They are so afraid of this person being in a happy commitment. They don't want this man being happy at all. If it's even to come in and give to you, it don't even got to be romantic. Just him even sharing words with you is bothering these people. You got to wonder why is it bothering them so much? Why? Why is it bothering them so much? They can't tell him. But he knows the truth already. It's because of insecurities. They don't want him to be friends with you. This is absolutely a king of source that's putting an end to a chapter and going through healing. Okay? This man strongly desires to heal. And you got these karmics, these lower energy. Yeah, someone is taking charge of their life to get the heck away from a situation because he knows the truth. So, damn. They're, they're, sir, threat with caution. These people are plotting your ending. I'm telling you, they're plotting your ending. They want you to be done. And I don't know if you're already going through some type of karma because of something you did. There's something where either they got this man cut up in some type of court case. Maybe had him locked up for something that he didn't even do. Tried to make something look very, very like a... Um, they tried to make it look legit, but it's not. I don't know what this is. Someone may have been set up and got locked up or this is what they're trying to do is set him up and get him locked up because he made a decision to go a specific direction. Made a decision to communicate with someone. To give to someone. He may just even be interested in the actual empress as far as maybe having some type of surrogate family like connection with this person like maybe uh an extended sister an extended uh, uh i don't know some type of feminine energy uh, uh relationship it, it may not even have to do with love but i do see a lot of cups out here so it could it could just be like a a, a platonic relationship like best friends or something like that but these people are so bothered by this so bothered Oh, bother. Dang. Anyways, thank you for watching. Stay blessed. I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye for now.